Thank you very much, Crystal. So we're now hearing from a classmate at Fleming Island High School after a student athlete collapsed while working out yesterday. He was taken to a nearby hospital, eventually transferred to Wolfson Children's Hospital. And Channel 4's Chris Brento has been following this story this morning. Chris, you know, also talking with people who may have known him. Any update on his condition? A lot of concern from classmates and a lot of sadness from classmates at Fleming Island High School. But the latest from the district came out last night and the district said that at that time he was in critical condition still. They have given us no update since then on his official condition. Taking a live look outside of Fleming Island High School right now. School back in session. Many students coming this morning with heavy hearts and their thoughts obviously with this student and with his family. Last night, the Fleming Island High School class of 2020 posted on social media that they wanted to honor this student and everyone is asked to wear blue today. They added the hashtag Fleming Island High School Strong. As students came to school today, this young man was on many people's minds. It's pretty sad. Everybody was in shock. Some people were crying. Some people were real worried. Some people were trying to help him. People called the hospital. Pretty sad, man. Out of, res out of respect for this young man and his family's privacy during this time, we are not naming him, but last night many on social media were posting their thoughts and prayers. Clay High Athletics tweeted, our thoughts and prayers go out to the athlete, his family, and the entire Fleming Island community. Oakleaf High School Softball retweeted, our hearts go out to his family and Fleming Island High School. So once again, the last update from the Clay County School District was that this young man is in critical condition. We hope to get more information from them later today. We've also requested a comment from Superintendent Addison Davis, but to this point, he has not made any official public comments. Live this morning, I'm Chris Parento, Channel 4, The Local Station.